Okay, I need somebody to help me assist. Raymond? Dude, whatever you need, I just don't want to it up. You, you can't say that word oh, in our Jesus. video. For God, oh my gosh. <laughs> Frank, I have to cut all of that out. Okay, come over here, Raymond. Can you work the camera? Ray's going out with us to dinner tonight. There we go. Can you look at that? <laughs> this is another one of Todd's tips. And we're going to share with the customer his Mega Touch Evo that we are delivering tomorrow. Uh, this is an Evo. This was the first of the flat screen models that came out in 2004, right up until the time Merritt went bankrupt. Ugh. Why? Gone. This is the 15 inch model. This has been updated with 2007 hardware. But the purpose of this video is for you to see how you can, in fact, calibrate any of the Force models. Now, here's the difference Mega Touch was one finger for years and years and years. Years and years. I think up until. I think 2004. Then they came out with the Mega Touch Force in both the Picture 2 version and the flat screens. The Forces allow two different fingertips to touch the screen at the same time. It has a different touch screen controller. I'm going to show you now. When we open this up like so, it swings open, and there's a cable in your game to hold it up. Now, there are an amazing amount of fans in this machine. There's a fan in the brand new power supply we always put in. There's a fan here. There's a fan here. There's a fan on the processor back here. And a final fan in the base. Fans a go-go. And still, you can cook eggs in this thing. But, the purpose of this video is to talk to you about uh, calibrating. This is the black controller. All the other ones have a white controller. The regular one, but the force controller has one slightly different feature, and that is you have to touch the screen for only two seconds. Now, the touch screen controller is down inside here. Can you put this down here, Raymond? This is held on by a little piece of Velcro. These are the monitor adjustment buttons, and these are your game options and calibration. Your calibration is always at the side. Now, that's held down by Velcro, that amazing, wonderful stuff. By simply pushing this button down once, you go into something called the calibration screen. You must reclose the machine so nothing is disturbed. And lock it. Has to be locked. Now, see your calibration screen? You only touch it twice, but this is the most important thing. I do the tip of my finger get a little bit moist so you get the absolute perfect touch and you want to calibrate it at the angle you're playing the game at. So if you sit low, you calibrate it wherever you're at playing. And here's the most important thing. Count out loud two seconds. 1001, 1002. 1001, 1002. Now your machine is perfectly calibrated. If you don't do it for two seconds, for some inexplicable reason, when you touch here, the thing could pop over there. It, it, it's just, it's uncanny, and it's not in any of the directions. That's what's most aggravating. I'm going to call Merritt about this. There's no tech tips or nothing on it. So, I'm telling you how to do it so you're not going nuts. We never figured out the two second rule until somebody told us. And now I'm telling you and thousands of other people calibrating your force. That's all there is to it. Now it's perfectly calibrated, and then we exit. And then we're out of our normal screen. Now, you clean your screen with Windex, but you don't squirt it on the tube. I see big arm. Funk, 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 funk. No, you don't do that. You squirt this on. There's nothing here. A t-shirt. 
Hey, I can use your old rag of a shirt, can I? <laughs> Squirt Windex. I'm not going to do it because actually we just replaced the touch screen. This is a brand new touch screen. You get it all clean. You have to do that, especially if you smoke in your house. That smoke goes right to the tube. Uh, actually, in this case, the LCD touch screen. <laughs> I don't laugh during my video. <laughs> We're going out to dinner tonight, and Ray, who's working the camera, is going with us. Oh, yes, you're going to buy Ray. You know, actually, when I think about this, somebody asked if we could bring the camera to dinner. So we're going to go out to dinner tonight, and we will bring the camera. We'll, we'll do that in the video we upload tomorrow. Anyway, it is done. The game's now ready to play. You can play Chunk Monkey. Would I be good at Chunk Monkey? Chunk Monkey. Oh, oh it's Chug. Chunk. Hurt. You know. Oh my gosh. I have to call Merritt. Yes, it's time. And look, I got a new phone. I memorized the number. 1-800-MERIT-2. M. I, they need to know about this. <sighs> They're going to be thrilled when I tell them that they can put this right up on the website. We're sorry. Oh. You have reached a number that oh. has been disconnected or is no longer in service. Uh. If you feel you have reached this recording in error... It doesn't get old, does it? Now, to the diner. Good night! <laughs> <laughs>